Some of us are giving our children traumatic stress disorder and don't even know it. Normal sex spotting bear bone broadcaster. My daughter has PT. <laughs> what? <laughs> her little boy died in her arms and well, I'll tell you where it started. I kept my daughter pretty close to me. Like a she bear. I did. And she keeps saying, Daddy, I'm ready to go play. Daddy, I'm ready to go play. Daddy, I'm ready to go play. I said, okay, go play. <sighs> Never been the same. Now she's come back a basket case. And they told her the damnest things, and they're still telling things about her. She has traumatic stress disorder, and they're telling her she's a, a prisoner and a drug addict and the damnest things. They, idiots. Telling her, oh, playing innocent victim. Jennifer Wilton doesn't have any ability to tell anybody about that. That remark gets you sued. You couldn't diagnose that. That's your diagnosis. You've got no business playing diagnosis from a report of someone else's failure about my daughter. Punk! Jennifer Wilton has no qualification to diagnose my daughter and does it with her eyeballs looking at her. Well, I'm not diagnosing you, Jennifer. I'm haunted by your dreams about your mother's inner lips casting you out and aspersioning the whole place. Because you're like a, a vertical that sucks on the bottom of a ship that's laying in the sand. And it uses false image of itself to lay there. A ship with a false image of itself laying and rotting in the sand. Shame on you, Jennifer. Shame on your mother. And her rotten crotch to strike you around to cling to the bottom of a sinking ship like you like to do and cast and tell things to people they don't know what they're doing. I don't know anything about you, Jennifer. All I know is the report I get of how you've affected somebody that I find very priceless. And everybody else did. Until she went around where they started telling her she wasn't priceless anymore and I did not know what was going on. I thought uh, where I had her going and take, they were telling her nice things about herself. And all the time she was picking up another image. Then she ran to some other people and really picked up an image. Then she got pregnant with an idiot that glared at her the whole time from the time he pulled his little weenie out to the time to the day he's still glaring at her. Why would you have an orgasm with a girl that you glare at? Why? What an idiot! The thing you glare at is not where you stick your orgasm. Punk! And then bring my offspring into it. And every grandchild and every great-grandchild MY OFFSPRING! Punk! Keep it straight! Punk! I'm the little bug and men in black that said, Don't do that again! Am I giving away my profile? Because I have to stay the softest heart here. My job is the softest heart. I'm calling a softer one among all of you. That's my job.